The overall goal of this procedure is to demonstrate our perfusion fixation technique that emphasizes the use of physiological pressures to properly preserve rat brain tissue for immunohistochemistry procedures. First, the use and setup of the perfusion apparatus is demonstrated. Then the tools needed to perform both the perfusion surgery and the brain removal are assembled and the deeply anesthetized animal is placed in the shallow tray filled with crushed ice. A 5 to 6 cm lateral incision through the integument and abdominal wall is made just beneath the rib cage. The heart is exposed and the animal is perfused. The final step is to remove the brain and place it in a vial of fixative containing fluid at least 10 times the volume of the brain itself. The overall goal of this procedure is to demonstrate our perfusion fixation technique that emphasizes the use of physiological pressures to properly preserve rat brain tissue for immunohistochemistry. We will start by preparing the perfusion rig. This will take about 10 minutes. Using a 50 milliliter syringe, repeatedly flush and clear the fixative line with buffer until all air bubbles are removed. It is crucial for the success of a perfusion not to have air bubbles in any of the lines. This is achieved by placing the outlet valve into a beaker filled with buffer. Now turn the exit valve off. Then remove the tube from the syringe while squeezing it so a drop of buffer hangs from the end. Place the filled tubing, the fixative inlet, into a bottle with 200 milliliters of paraffin.